That's a perfectly good sock. Just ignore us. Yes, don't mind us. Pretend we're not here. Okay. You're not Jock Cranley, are you? Actor and artist? I love your work! Oh, stunt double? Oh, our favorite show. Mrs. Thornhill! Snap! Watch the birdie! Oh, pretend to throttle me. <laughs> yeah, like you did on that, on that poster you did. Yeah, okay, all well, that would be my pleasure. <laughs> oh. uh, like that, huh? Yeah? Oh. Uh, uh, maybe something oh. like this? Or oh. like that? Huh? You like that? Oh, that's enough, huh? dear. You like that? Oh. 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 Please. Oh, hey. Oh. Oh. Thank you. Mm, wow, that's quite a woman oh. there, huh? Oh. We are not worthy. We're, We're not, not worthy. worthy. We're, We're not I'm, worthy. Uh, I'm not Jock, uh, what's his name? Cranley. Big star in the 80s. We well, love celebs. Oh. That's why we came to Tinseltown. Yes. Yeah. Before we met you, we were trying to break in to Bruce Spade's house and steal his rubbish. The things these stars throw away. They're not like you or me. <laughs> Mrs. Thornhill has the most unbelievable collection of celebrity underwear and bathroom products. Things they've actually used themselves. You guys have a great vacation, all right? I gotta go. We could do with some help. All this climbing over walls and rooting through bins. It's such a business. Nigel's got an arthritic knee. Yeah. What do you, uh, what do you need? Just a few Vinewood souvenirs for my mm. museum. Look, 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 look at this map. I mean, a lot of these places have famous people living in them and some that are just hanging about. Bring us some things. I'd be very thankful indeed. Americans are the most wonderful people in the world, aren't they? The best! <laughs> <laughs> Such fun! <laughs> <laughs> oh, a pair of fruitcakes. I said it, Mrs. Thornhill. 
I, uh, persuaded Mark Faustenberg to donate one of his golf clubs to your Museum of Dysfunction. Oh, bravo! It will take pride of place on the wall above Jill von Krastenberg's pregnancy test. <laughs> Speak to you soon! I love Americans. You're all so brash and uncomplicated. A dog. What is it with you people? Doggy, come on, doggy. Be good to daddy. There, there. I know this is weird for all of us. You're gonna make a batshit crazy lady very happy. <sighs> okay, huh? now get back to Jerry before she uses this as an excuse to go back to rehab. Jock. Celebrity newsflash! Maniac steals collar from Carrie McIntosh's dog in Rockford Hills! Oh, how delightful! Mrs. Thornhill will have me sporting that in the bedroom before the week is out. <laughs> oh, I, I, I joke, of course. <laughs> we really can't thank you enough for all the effort you're going to to make our holiday so special. Ah, don't mention it. I always enjoy meeting people more chemically unbalanced than myself. Jefe me va a matar. Mm, ¿Dónde está? to be a four-digit calorie burn. Really even definition. Yo, it is like I'm airbrushed, but I am not. How do you like me now, Chloe? I'm not kidding. This might be the best I've ever looked. Who'd have thought it? Turns out I'm a weapons-grade celebrity stalker. This is Nigel. Please be quick. I'm roaming in the United States of America. It's me and Nutcase. I picked up some clothes from your friend Tyler Dixon. There's even a skid mark. What fantastic news! Wait till Mrs. Thornhill hears about this. Oh, she will be pleased as punch. Trends. Don't mind if I do. I can't believe. 
Okay, which one of you cupcakes is Willie? Hey, who the fuck are you? <laughs> his dentist! Well, he's still downstairs chatting up some bird, man. Whoa, his dentist comes to him? That is so cool. I bet I could hit. Hey, man, no more autographs. Hey, that's okay. I want something more personal. Piss off, you twat, before I kick your ass. <laughs> I'd say my work is done here. You crazy English fruit cake? Oh, I'm dreadful at guessing, aren't I, Mrs. Thornhill? No, she can't hear me. She's washing out a nappy from Samantha Muldoon's dustbin. Yeah, uh, one gold tooth, courtesy of Love Fist, complete with complimentary DNA. Marvelous, marvelous. Oh, Jock, I knew you wouldn't let us down. Toodaloo! It's a true wonderland. Hey, there you are, hmm? Jock. Yeah, I got you that stuff. Oh, great. Thank you. Where's your wife? Mrs. Thornhill, she's mm. not my wife. She's got a husband and two lovely kiddies at home. We met online. It's n nothing sexual. Where is she? Well, she's been trying to throw herself under celebs wheels <laughs> well, well she can throw herself under my wheels anytime oh <laughs> i knew you were funny jock yeah i knew i would like you C can i have a hug okay yeah uh, hug, yeah uh, come here, come here. Uh, i've got a pr protruding hip it's not a semi nigel Jock, no. you won't believe what's happened! What? Only Alden Appley walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among, among us. us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Not me! I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad luck, and we were such fans. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruin everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. You see, like that little lockup I know. No problemo. Look, there he is! Oh, shit. It's that crazy English bitch again. Nigel, he remembers me! To the chariot! Jock, you drive. Quick, he's getting away! Come on, Jock, get in! He's taking a left turn down the high street, Jock! Did you ever imagine we might get a private audience with Al Di Napoli? Only in my wildest dreams! All those nights spent role-playing in Mother's utility room. If only we'd known! I loved him in the Redeemer. Careful! Loved him in the Redeemer. Oh, Nigel, do your Al Di Napoli line! This is turban warfare, motherfucker! <laughs> 
It's uncanny! <laughs> oh, dear. Poor Jock must think we're bad. Oh, don't be silly. I hear that behind his charitable public face, he's remarkably right-wing. One can but hope. Liberal in the bedroom, conservative at the border, Mrs. Thornhill. <laughs> I love this country. What on earth will we feed the man? I hadn't even thought of that. He probably eats sushi or quinoa. Is that even how you say it? What if he wants meth? He's going into the car park! The car park? No worries, mate! Oh, I hope he likes us! How could he not? This lockup you prepared si Oh, my giddy eye! Everything okay there, Earl Crazy Cakes? My prostate has taken quite a beating. Do you have to lower the tone? Glad to see you on the proper side of the road, dear boy. This must be second nature to you, Jock. All those stunts you used to do. This level up. Is he going through the hospital? Oh, my lord! Hold on to your corsets! Uh, seems rude not to follow him through the window. Would you like me to escort your guest of honor to the trunk? Well, if you don't mind. Oh, come here, you. Come on. Come on. Let me meet your biggest fan. Ah. Oh, you're fucking crazy. Oh, it's Get off me. Uh, You're good to go. Ah, a true gentleman. This is so exciting. Nut jobs. Pull it together. <laughs> <laughs>